Hello everyone, so today's video is going to be the nursery makeover. Here's a look back at what this room looked like two years ago when we bought this fixer upper house. This room got completely renovated with the rest of the house, new wall texture, paint, doors, carpet, and trim. And then later on, we added a light fixture to this room and made a dark accent wall. The accent wall color is peppercorn and then the wall color in here is agreeable gray. I used this room as my office for the last 10 months and now we are going to turn it into a nursery for our three month old baby Levi. This dark accent wall will be perfect to put the crib up against and we'll be leaving the light fixture and the curtains and the blind as well. So all we need to do here is add furniture and decor to turn this room into a cute little nursery. Before we get started, Jalen wanted to add four small canned lights in the ceiling because this room has terrible lighting so he hoped that some small canned lights could help improve that. I was laying out a few of the rugs that we have on hand to see if any of these would work in here and then I'm going to vacuum the floor. There was a little bit of a mess in here from cutting the holes for the little can lights. It wasn't too bad though because he did have that little plastic container that hooked onto the bottom of his drill and that caught most of the mess. So it wasn't too bad but I just wanted to get the whole floor vacuumed, do some dusting in here and just get it ready to start setting up the furniture and decorating. Now Jalen's going to get the crib set up in here. I couldn't decide if I wanted to do an all white crib or just an all natural wood looking crib. So I just went for one that was wood and white. This one is really cute and I'll put a link for it down below. This crib is the Soho convertible crib in the white natural color. It's from the brand Da 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 on the Newton Baby website. I chose this one because I loved how simple and open it was. I love the white color with this wood base. The wood base just gives it something a little Little bit extra. It's very sturdy, good quality, and just a great crib that's going to last him for years because it is a convertible crib, so it has a little toddler rail that we can put on once he's a toddler. Now it's time to set up the dresser and I just wanted to put a small dresser in this room because like I said it is a fairly small room and so I didn't want to put like a huge 60 inch you know normal sized dresser in the room so I was looking for something that was about 40 to 50 inches long and I searched and searched online for a long time trying to find something that would be a good price and would match the room I was looking at wood dressers and also white dressers and I ended up finding this white dresser it was 47 inches long Long, the perfect size it had great reviews and was also a great price
Jalen got Levi's crib put together here. It's really cute and sturdy. I love the white with the wood base. So now I'm going to unbox his mattress and this mattress is from Newton Baby. I feel like this is the best and safest mattress that we could have gotten for him. It's 100% breathable, it's washable, it's recyclable, and a two-stage crib mattress. So we chose the white color. I think they have four different colors, gray, blue, pink, and white. This one's the white. I'll go ahead and get it unboxed so you can see what it looks like here. And Newton Baby is also sponsoring today's video, so you can get $50 off your Newton crib mattress plus free shipping by using my link and code down below. And you can also get 100 nights of sleep on Newton Baby. And if you're not happy, Newton offers free returns. I just realized I had baby spit up on my shoulder the whole time I was unboxing the mattress, but oh well. It's just life with the baby, right? Levi's almost three months old, so he's rolling all over the place now. So when he's sleeping, he'll roll on his stomach, roll back on his back. So that just gives us as parents such a peace of mind and comfort when he's in here sleeping, knowing that his mattress is 100% breathable. It allows air to flow freely for optimal breathability and temperature regulation. This mattress is made with absolutely no foam, latex, or adhesives. It's hypoallergenic and completely washable, which I think is so awesome that this entire mattress is washable. So the cover of this mattress completely unzips off. And then you can just put this in the washing machine to clean it. And I'll set him down and show you what the core looks like. Okay, so here is what the core of the mattress looks like. How awesome is that? You can literally put this right in the tub or the shower to clean it and keep it bacteria free. This is just a really awesome mattress and company. So if you're wanting to order a Newton baby mattress, like I said, you can get $50 off with my link and my code down below. And you'll also get free shipping and you do get to try it for 100 nights of sleep on Newton baby. And if you're not happy, Newton offers free returns. Jalen is building a simple wood frame to go around the changing pad on top of the dresser. The crib is white with that wood base like you saw, so I wanted to bring some of that wood color over to the dresser as well just to help to break up all of the white. So we'll be adding a wood mirror, some shelves, a basket, and then this wood frame for the changing pad. This changing pad cover is from Amazon. It's really soft and cute. I love all of the little mountains on it and it brings in the pops of blue and green that I was wanting to bring into the room. These baskets are from the Spring Shop collection at Hobby Lobby. I showed them in my Hobby Lobby shopping video and I just thought they'd be perfect for the nursery. The large one I put here by the dresser to put all of his dirty laundry in and then the smaller one I'm going to put his toys in. And of course you need a trash can with a lid for dirty diapers in the nursery so I got this one from Target, put it on the right side of the dresser. These are the spice racks from Ikea that you can also use as a bookshelf. I bought these years ago for Owen's nursery and I painted them white and I had them in the boys closet and was storing some books on them but I decided to put them here in Levi's nursery but I didn't want to have a full white shelf on the wall. I wanted it to have just a little touch of wood to it so we just sanded off the front part so that just the bar across the front would have the wood look and then the rest of the shelf would be white and I think it turned out really cute. Helped to bring that pop of wood over here to the wall.
These drawer organizers I got from Target about a year ago and they were perfect to just put all of his lotion, different little things like that, his pacifiers and everything in this top drawer. And then I'm going to organize his clothing in the rest of the drawers. That little wooden camera I thought was so cute. It was from the hearth and hand section at Target and it had all of the colors that I wanted to bring into his room, the green, the navy blue, the white, the wood. So I thought it would be cute to just set right here on his dresser. Fox canvas is from Hobby Lobby and it's probably my favorite decor piece in his room. It's so cute. I love all of the colors in it and it goes with the theme in his room. I didn't go over the top with a the theme in here, just kept it very minimal and simple, but I did do a little bit of a woodland theme. You can see the foxes and then I have the mountains on his changing pad cover and then also my mom sewed him a blanket that has woodland animals on it. So just a little touch of the woodland theme in here. finally decided which rug to put in the nursery. This one was over in the media room and we decided to just move it over here. I wanted something simple and soft so this woven wool rug is perfect for in here. And then the rocking chair I got a few months ago from Target. box his first toys from Loverly. This right here is the play mat with toys and then this is his first play kit from them. It's four weeks zero through twelve. I'm gonna set this play mat up just right here on the floor because I'll probably just leave this play mat back in his room all the time with the toys. I'm adding a crib sheet to the mattress and don't forget if you had wanted to order a Newton baby mattress you can get $50 off and free shipping with my link and my code in the description box. This is the blanket that my mom sewed for Levi, so that's really special to have here in his room. And I just put it in the crib for the video. I usually have it over on the rocking chair. I don't have anything in the crib when he sleeps in there, obviously. I ordered this custom wood sign from an Etsy shop, and that was just the perfect finishing touch for his room in here. So I got that nailed up on the wall, and now his little nursery is complete. I just love how it turned out. It's so cute in here and just cozy and just the perfect little space for him.
so that is going to be it for this nursery makeover video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next week with a new video. Bye!